So today we are making a six pieces skirt, but we are going to use pattern to draft it first. And on my next video, we will join the pieces together and see how it will comes out. So now we have our ruler, our marker, our scissors, and our tracing way that we use to trace it. So let's start with the measurement. So starting with the measurement, you start from the waist. So that is the waist, that is the upper side is the waist, so that is the hip line, hip line is 8, that is the half length of the skirt, the half length is 18, and that is the full length, the full length is 39, and the hem allowance will add 1 inch, making it 40, that is the length, so let's get started with the measurement now, so from your waist, you you divide your waist, our waist that we are using is 30. So you divide 30 by 4, what will it give you? It will give you 7 on your table, so you mark. So that is the hip line. The hip line is 40, and you divide it by 4, and it will mark. So that is the marking there now. We are not adding any allowance because it's a pattern paper. So when we are draft cutting it on the fabric that's where we now add our allowance so from the hip now to the style line that is the half length you will now subtract from your hip what will you have there i'm having 37 so now you connect from the waist to your hip so from there from your hip to your half length so from your half length now down to the M line so now that is what I'm doing there now so you take it so you from your half length now take it down to the M line so that is what I'm doing I'm shifting it upper for you to see how I will take it down so you use your ruler to draw it down so that is what I'm doing there now so on that M line you also mark that 37 because that is what you we have for the half length there so you continue to connect it straight down so that is what i'm doing now i'm connecting it straight down after that now so what next you will see what we will do there now so i'm just connecting it down first so the connecting is done we've connected it so that is the straight line We've gotten and we've gotten our measurement. So now is we'll start our proper six pieces pattern that is to get the flare. So what I'm doing there now, I will mark from the waist. What I'm marking there now is four. So I will mark four to get a straight line down. So that is what I will do there now. So I'm just putting it well. For us to see clearly so it's four that i'm marking there so what you just continue to mark your four down so i'm marking the four down after marking it you just use your ruler to roll it also down so that is four that i've marked throughout to the length so we've gotten our four there now so you you use your ruler now to roll it so i want to roll it to get at the straight line so that is the rolling side that I want to roll now. So I'm rolling it now. So the rolling is in progress. So I'm rolling it down. Rolling it. That is to get that straight line. Remember it's four that I mark. So you continue. So that's what I'm doing there now. Continue rolling it down. Why just taking time is just because the ruler is not long enough but we'll get the length so that is the rolling side that i'm rolling now that is the center of the front is what i've done there now so now we're done with that so what next now is just for us now to start from that point that i'm pointing it that is the half length of the skirt so from that middle of that four that we mark so come to the down side of it i'm marking Four. So what I'm marking there is what we'll now use to get our flare. 
and marking that fold here. So on the other side, you place your tape on the middle side again and mark four. So that is the four. So for the outside of it, so I'm marking four. So that is the flare now. We are connect getting there now. So after that now you I'm rolling it out again so that the ruling will reach to the hemline there. So now we're done with that. So to connect it now from that four that we mark, you take it to that your half length. So from that half length now is what I'm marking it down to that for that we marked for us to get our flare. All this process is for us to get our flare. So that is the flare now that I'm marking to connect it. So after that, from the other side again, you connect. So that is what I want to do there too. So I'm pointing it for you to see. So you mark that is take your ruler to rule it to connect it to that four that we mark and that's where we are doing there now is the middle side the center front of the skirt so don't forget to subscribe to my channel so this video is six pieces pattern that we are making so for the other side that we are marking and marking it from that half length also taking it down to that for that we marked so for us to get our six pieces skirt flare so that's what i'm marking there now so can you see how it is now so on that now we will now use our tracing way so that's why we have that tracing way so first we'll cut it so i'm cutting the side of it now so to start tracing it now so now is the cutting removing that uh, side of it now remember we we'll also use this pattern to cut both the back and the front but all the process is that we want to get that our six pieces skirt so that is what i'm doing there now so and don't be confused we didn't put any allowance because it's a pattern by the time we want to use it to cut the main fabric that's when we now add our allowance on it and you will also see that so we're done with it so that pieces that remain that the pattern paper we also use it to lay at the downside now so that we we'll now place this um, pattern and use it to trace so i'm laying the other side of the pattern paper so I want to place it down so that we will now use it to trace the middle side. So it's the middle side that we want to trace now. That is the front side of the skirt of these six pieces. So you just lay it the way you are seeing it there now. And use things to hold it down so that by the time you want to trace, it will shift. So that is what I'm doing there now. So I'm putting things on top so that we will not trace it out and i hope the video is showing you everything for you to see see though that place that i just point out now is where you will not trace it. so that is the way we will trace it now so we will use our tracing winner to trace it now so i want to trace it now so can you see what we are pointing out that is the side you will trace so the tracing we are started tracing it now so that is the tracing side that we are doing and that is the middle side of the six pieces that we are tracing out so this is how you draft your pattern while cutting your six pieces on your pattern paper and remember it's a skirt that we are making six pieces skirt so that is the tracing side of it now that i'm tracing so just hold it down so that it will shift so that is why I also put all these things on top that you are seeing for it not to sh uh, shift. So that is it now. So I'm tracing it now and the tracing is almost done. That will now take out the pattern on it and cut it out. So we're done with the tracing now. So can you see how it is now? So I will just 
take away all those things that is on top and move it and cut it out. So kind. So this is it now. So we done it. So um, can you see the line now? So I will point it out for you now to see how it is. So that is the line now, and that is where we want to cut. So I want to cut it out now. So that is the side that I'm cutting, like the so, uh, front side of the pattern that we are tracing and we are cutting it out now. So it's almost done. So don't forget to subscribe to my channel and watch it to the end. So I'm tracing, I'm cutting it now. So that is the cutting of the pattern paper that I'm cutting and remember it's six pieces that we are cutting six pieces cut that we are cutting now so that is it now so it's done so just to demarcate it I will use my marker to demarcate it writing CF that is the front side of it now so can you see that is the center side the front so I will also use it to cut the back also so now we want to cut the side now so where are we cutting now so i will also point it out for you to see so that is where we'll cut out now so you see where i'm cutting watch it very well so that you know if you want to do your own house you know where to cut so this we am cutting out to get our side six pieces cut so and you can also watch it again to see we are also trace to get the front side of it now. So this we are um, cutting now. So can you see how it is now? This cutting is coming out and the shape is coming out. And our six pieces skirt is almost ready now. So can you see how it is now? So this are uh, it comes out and this are uh, you can draft your six pieces skirt. So. I want to also demarcate it also for you to see. So can you see how it is now? So I will use my marker to demarcate the side. So just write SS so to see that that is the side of the skirt. So can you see how it is now? Very lovely. And just watch this video down to the end and make a comment. So that is how it is. And you also see how the outcome will be. That's why I'm also encouraging you to watch the next video that I want to upload that is to finish it to cut it in pieces and also to join it and sew it out so that is how it is now so can you see how it is so this eye will come out by the time we finish joining the pieces on my next video so thank you for watching 